Look at this guy. This is ready in a nutshell. Okay. Okay. So, Aaron, why are you holding a toothbrush today? Because Michael is going to inspect my teeth. Okay. <laughs> it's a really big deal. Doing this checkup is going to be amazing. And you know why? It's because we are going to see what it looks like after how many years? 13. 13, 13 years 13. of no dentist. What is a mouth going to look like? <laughs> this is exciting. I'm really excited. Let's go in the clinic. We're already here. We're going to go check it out. It's Sunday, so I have to kind of sneak in. And we're going to do that. <laughs> you brush them before the dentist? This is for you, Michael. This is for your sake. <laughs> And you're a good man. You can tell I definitely don't do my own x-rays because it took me about five minutes just to find the on button on the computer that controls the x-rays. So <laughs> it's gonna be fine. We're gonna get through this. Doing okay? Mm-hmm. Based on his x-rays. But <laughs> yeah, the good news is, is that your teeth are still in good shape. And once we fix up those cavities, um, all we have to do is some fillings and you're gonna be back to square one. And, you know, considering it's been 13 years, it's not bad at all. How many total? So, good work. Don't want to break anything expensive. <laughs> Thank you. You should, you should do this dentist thing more often. <laughs> yeah, probably should. <laughs> so during Aaron's checkup, we were just looking for any signs of oral cancer, which we didn't find and we're making sure all the silver fillings he had in his mouth were doing okay. Some of them did have some issues. For example, there was one tooth on the bottom left that had a chip out of the tooth there. He did have some buildup, which is typical when you haven't been to the dentist in a while, so we just cleaned that up for him. We'll definitely wanna make sure he sees a hygienist to get the rest off, but we got a good majority of it off there for him. Here you can see one of the cavities actually shining through. The white decalcification that you see there is because the cavity underneath has affected the enamel and it is becoming weaker and weaker. Eventually this will break. So Aaron, six cavities, not so bad, hey? The good news is, is that if we get at these cavities sometime in the next couple months, then you won't ever need a root canal or anything like that. Five. <laughs> yes. Bye everybody. See you. So I figured while I was editing this vlog, I should probably introduce you guys to who Aaron is. Well, he is gonna be marrying the best friend, no, the sister of our best friends. And we're actually gonna be filming and photographing his wedding in March, so that's super exciting. But as a wedding gift, Aaron, what we would love to do for you is fix all your cavities for free the next time you're down in Medicine Hat. We love you guys and we would love to have you back at the clinic for one more adventure. Maybe we'll film that too. If you guys like this video, make sure to hit that subscribe button and we will see you next time.